Meanwhile, plans to build a shorter train route between Taipei and Yilan are under fire for their potential damage to water quality in northern Taiwan. Two of three proposed plans will have the trains pass through the Feitrei Reservoir catchment area. According to reservoir operators, if construction of either of the two plans takes place, Taipei could face 15 years of dirty water. People traveling between Taipei and Ilan have several choices. Drivers can take the Beiyi Highway or go through the Shuishan Tunnel. Another is spending 65 minutes on a train. <laughs> to reduce time spent using this latter option, the Ministry of Transportation wants to build a direct line between the two cities. It has drafted three plans. The first would take 39 minutes to go between Nangang and Tocheng. The second, at 34 kilometers long, would be even shorter. The third would take 47 minutes to travel from Nangan to Dashi via Xuanxi. The first two options have a speed advantage, but they would pass through the Feitse Reservoir catchment area. Reservoir operators say water quality would be damaged during a decade of construction and over another five years of restoration. KMT lawmaker Ji Guodong expressed concern. Are the economic benefits worth everyone drinking polluted water for 15 years? asked Chi. Responsible agencies should conduct a careful analysis. Transportation Minister Ye Guangshi says the project is in the planning stages and will have to pass environmental assessment. Without approval from regulators, construction won't begin.